So if you're a content creator or editor, you know that you need the right tools in order to make the best content possible. And a lot of the time that involves converting footage of some sort. So in this video, I'm going to be showing the best possible video converter. If you are a YouTuber editor, or you just want to try it out just because. So if that interests you, stay tuned because we're going to hop right into it right now. Some of you guys may not know it, but I actually did a review on hit pause software a little while ago, and I'm excited to actually check out the new version of their video converter software. As you guys can see right here, I do have have the software booted up on my PC and I'm just going to be showing you guys some of the main features of the software showing them in action how you could actually utilize them for your own content so the first example I'm going to use is the main convert feature so this is actually just going to be pretty much what you came to the video for it's going to be converting footage of some sort so for example if we navigate on my PC and we find some sort of footage that we want to use so for example let's say I want to convert a video right here I'll drag it in in, and it will preview this video right here. This is a face recordings thing I had for a thumbnail, so ignore that. But it does give us some options here like we can see. So for example, we can rename it to whatever we'd like. I can name it Josh Face Cam or something like that. And then it also gives us the basic rundown of the file, what the resolution is, whatnot. And then from there, we're also able to get rid of the audio tracks, add an audio track, which is super cool. And then right here is where we actually dive into the altering of settings. So if we click on this MP4 thing right here, it pulls up a massive window and this gives us a bunch of conversion options so we can convert it to 4k. Um, it's already 1080, 720, 480, and that's MP4. We can come down here to MOV. This is the same thing. MKV, M4V, AVI, HEVC. There's so many different, look at all these, so many different types of formats right here that we can literally convert it to in a matter of seconds. It also offers audio files so we can convert it to an MP3. So there's just the audio and there's all these different ones right here we can change the bit rate of each file and then there's also device so if we want to import this file to let's say an iphone 14 we would click on the formatting for that device or even just a different device here and then the last tab is social video and this is really good because if you have a youtube video you want to format it for tiktok you literally just click on tiktok pick the resolution and it will format it in a resolution that's supported by uploading to tiktok i'm just going to convert it to an mov 1080p right here and we'll just press convert and just like that it shows us the progress as well as a timer that says remaining how much time is remaining in the conversion and for some reason i thought my file was an mp4 originally so it was an mov in the first place so we pretty much just converted it to the exact same file but you get the idea that's pretty much that and there's two features right up here that i didn't touch up on and that's hardware acceleration as well as lossless conversion lossless conversion you just keep it on trust me it's the best and it renders things way faster and then also we can see the file that did finish uh, loading right here and we actually can play it <laughs> that's the cringy zen joshi uh, face cam stuff like that for thumbnails ignore it moving on to the edit tab here it does show a bunch of different features which i'm only going to go into like one or two so for example there's the cut and all we would do is we would find a video that we want to use so i'm going to use the exact same video because why not it's going to add it and then we can directly use this as an editor to add cuts to these different things and make separate things so we can remove that one if we want to remove of the beginning part if we want to so we're just left with these two parts right here and that's kind of a cool feature to use to be honest because it just allows you to you know edit videos even basic i mean you can make basic cuts you're not going to be editing videos in here but you guys get the idea now moving on to the merge this would be for combining videos together cropping pretty self-explanatory crop the video and rotate it filter i'm going to show you guys this one here because i thought it was really cool we actually are given a bunch of different presets for color correction which is super cool and it gives us the preview right here we just press confirm and then press export and just like that we'd have the video actually in that color correction state so i'm just gonna get rid of this again so i could show you guys we could also change the speed change it to 2x add a watermark even adjust the volume directly in the software which is super super cool and yeah that is pretty much but yeah that's pretty much the edit tab summarized as best that i can now toolbox this is a cool thing because it features so many different features the image and video compressor this is obviously if you want to decrease the size of a video so for example if we have something like this i'm just going to quickly show you this video right here it's 251 megabytes 
and when we compress it it goes down to 125 but we can actually change that so we can change the compression down to smaller size but it will kind of tank the quality a little bit not really to a noticeable level if you don't drag it down too much but that's pretty much that video to gif pretty self-explanatory spotify music converter pretty self-explanatory image editor pretty self-explanatory noise removers for background noise background removers pretty simple as well i mean for example let's try a picture of shirtless josh for some reason because why not it actually did a good job jeez okay so the background's gone it's just, it's just me now so that's kind of cool we can change the background color okay so that's really this is actually a cool feature all right that's cool like you guys can see the video would be like 25 minutes long if i showed you everything that actually the toolbox offers you guys can try it out for yourself if you want to check it out it's gonna be the first link in the description as well as the pinned comment uh, but yeah go check that out great software i mean it's it packs a punch for the four different tabs that it has it does feature a lot of stuff so if you guys want to do that first link in the description go check out hip pause video converter software it's amazing i love it i'm going to be using it for my own content and yeah see you later